I'm Virginia McGathy here on the floor at the CME Group reporting to you on the livestock market. Let's talk with cattle surging again today. Wholesale prices up, sending the futures up for the sixth day in a row. The market really surged right into the auction today at 11 o'clock. After the auction came uh, came out, uh, the markets really hung around at 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 highs. And then what happened was uh, some profit taking came in and really started to bring it down uh, and uh, settling the market in a little bit. Possibly this is the new high for this week, but some profit taking came in and started to to you know bring the market back a little bit. We are in oversold conditions, so it is vulnerable to a little bit of a correction. Now the feeders also were railing up. Actually, they made a new contract high up over 1% as well. There's certainly, that shows some optimism uh, in the future, but we have been rallying so, for so many days, it's really difficult to keep that going without some real fundamental news coming in. On the other hand, the lean hog market has been struggling. It's still waiting for uh, some uh, pork demand, some, uh, some positive uh, fundamental news that might get this market off the ground. It's still hovering over towards its lows and been hanging there really for the past number of sessions. Uh, the only good thing about it is traders are, are uh, very shy to start selling it at this point because we're really kind of at the bottom. We expected much of a bounce before uh, this Easter holiday. It definitely did not come. Uh, possibly will it come after? That remains to be seen. It's kind of difficult because there are a lot of hogs in the pipeline right now. Uh, if we get some change of heart, possibly with the uh, cattle market, the beef prices being so high, maybe we're going to get some consumers to switch over to the pork market. But that hasn't happened as of yet. So uh, it's still, uh, hogs are still struggling somewhat. Not a big washout today, but still kind of still on its lows. That's all from the floor at the CME Group. I'm Virginia McGaffey.